Well, Kerman, this tutorial is for the IT2, for the AS ICT, and this is for the complex sound. Now, what you are required to do is to go on, for example, YouTube and to go and get um, a, a sound that you can import. So you need to take print screen evidence. So, for example, you take a print screen showing the sound online and you'd put that into a Word document. OK, so we're going to copy this URL and you need to take this URL into um, a web browser called floor.com or fluvor. You can paste that URL and we are going to change it into M going to change it into MP3. Okay, so now we've downloaded it. Right, we can open up Audacity now and we can import the audio. All right, so this is our sound. We've got it from the internet and now we need to edit it. So what I would suggest you do, you take a print screen showing your original sound. Right, so print screen showing your original style, put it into a Word document, and then you know what it looked like at the start, and it's obvious to the moderators that you've edited it. So I'm going to do a bit of a Christmassy video. Okay, so we can go to effects, we can cut if we don't want this part on it. And we're gonna have a party tonight because Santa Claus has come to town. my movie is going to probably be a maximum of a minute so I can cut that bit and maybe fade out I need to go to effects we've got some fade out we've got some fade in make sure obviously you're having a look is there an area so if we play it is there an area? And we're gonna have a tonight the because Santa Claus has come to town and the kids are running around because So have a look at different effects. Could you repeat fade in? He's the tree. Oh, I guess we know be. If you do add another sound in, doesn't matter. You know, it's got to fit your purpose. Remember, it is a level, and the moderator will listen to it. When you do that, print screen show in the original. Right, so you can move it around and get rid of what's the sound look. You can change the bass by dragging it in. Cut different sizes. Fade in and out. All right, so once you've done that, You can then export it ready to put into your actual movie. Okay, but just show the evidence of you creating everything. Make sure it fits your purpose. So if you're doing um, a Christmas video, then make sure it sounds like Christmas. If you're doing a happy, upbeat one, make sure you've got a happy, upbeat sound that you've got. Okay, so we can file, export, and you can export as your MP3 or your WAV. It's up to you. Alright, so we've got our original sound and they will be exported as one layer. And so you can print the screen any different effects that you've done. So you can print the screen showing that everything's going to be flattened before you export. Good luck.